first half passing attack versus the second half passing attack. What changed? A few things. Ben Roethlisberger took advantage of all the quick passes that they had been throwing and baited the Colts. He then defined things for his young wide receivers, and the combination of that allowed for some explosive plays. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to look at one of those plays in the first half that helped create one of those big plays, in fact, a touchdown in the second half. Let's take a look at one of the plays towards the end of the first half. Let's focus at the bottom of the screen. Johnson, who's on the numbers, next wide receiver closest to him is Connor, who's in the backfield. The Colts are going to play a quarters coverage to this side of the field. The corner over Johnson is responsible for the numbers to the out of bounds. The next defensive back inside is responsible for the numbers to the hash area. Now at the snap of the ball, the Colts stay quarters coverage. Ben sees this, so should Johnson. In fact, Johnson does a great job initially of widening the corner. This is vital because Ben's going to throw the go route here and he's got to keep that ball inside the numbers. If Johnson keeps widening that corner and stays inside the numbers, this has a chance to be a big play, if not a touchdown. But Johnson starts to wander back into the numbers and therefore it's incompleted. Well, in the second half, they make some adjustments to take advantage of this Colts coverage. Okay, let's look at a play in the second half and how they took advantage of the things they learned in the first half. Focus on Johnson, who's at the top of the screen. Connor, this time, is not in the backfield. He's in the slot. The Colts are playing the same type of coverage to that side of the field, a quarters-type coverage. Corner responsible for the numbers to the out-of-bounds. Safety responsible for the hash mark to the numbers. Initially, the Steelers are going to want what looks like a slant play. This is what they'd been running in the first half, a lot of quick passes. Ben's going to look to the left like he did in that other play. Johnson is going to look like he's coming into a slant. The corner bites on that. But instead of a slant route, they run a slant and go. So they took the things they learned in the first half and they applied them in the second half, understanding the coverage they would see and defining it for their wide receiver. One of the key ingredients to a great passing attack is chemistry. That everybody sees the same thing the same way. Quarterback sees the coverage the way the wide receivers see the coverage. That allows for explosive plays. Well, let's hope what happened with the Colts game, that level of chemistry has evolved even further because it is going to be vital in beating the Cleveland Browns and having success in the playoffs. What's up, Steeler Nation? It's your boy, Juju Smith-Schuster here. Thanks for watching the video. Make sure you like and comment below. And don't forget to subscribe to the Steelers' official YouTube channel. Thanks again. Here we go, Steelers.